let's see how much of this first half I remember. Spin. to get past this first, the first two block jumps, which are still really hard for me. I didn't switch to spin before I ran off the edge. So good. Oh, I went too early. I don't know why I jumped on that platform there. Okay. I remember now. First try. Oh no, screen wrap. Okay, looks so this is a more traditional sky tree. I don't know why it stopped where it did. Screen wrap breaks my brain. see if I can trigger that from the bottom. Nope, you have to jump from the top. And then do that. Okay. I see. So just jump better going up the line. I didn't know which way to go. I saw the yellow arrow and I was like, go to the block. And that was wrong. And then I ran out of time.
Get in the pipe, please. Ow! Oh, I struggled too much to get in the pipe. I'm kidding. This doesn't seem too bad. The second half seems way easier. It's more of a traditional sky tree. Hate my jump there. I don't know what I was doing. Hesitate there. I don't know why. I can't remember which way to go, so I have to look at it, which slows me down. No way. <laughs> I fogged. I do it. I knew I was gonna make that. Okay, the second half seems way better. Or way easier than the block jumps on um, the first half. I'm just not good at block jumps, clearly. I didn't know I had to hit that. And that's the end. Oh my god. Okay. The second half is way easier than the first half. I'm shocked I was glad that the second half was a more traditional sky tree. Oh, it doesn't look like it's coming. I was too slow, I guess, uh, breaking that block. dead. That's so many fogs. Up oh, pipes. much much smoother I, I, I had a feeling something was gonna drop down the vine and kill me it's a good thing you can just go and not have to wait uh, for it to drop oh both of the branching paths are dead ends I guess this is the last switch palace and then we go back to the beginning, and then there's a whole other path. Okay, interesting. Interesting map layout. Okay, jungle and temple. Less than 10 minutes. I spent who knows how long on that one level yesterday. Okay, spin. That was way too big, okay. Oh, got it, okay. I didn't realize that was a turn block. It looked like the uh, Mario solid. I could not get the grab block. Holy crap. Okay. So far, this one seems pretty good. I like, I really like the art in this one. The yellow spikes and all the, uh, the jungle temple poles and junk.
We've seen that one move in this hack a lot. Okay, go over and then something. I wish I could look at it. Oh shit, okay. I see. I just had to drop faster. At least I've got this first jump semi consistently. Did not get the grab block. You have to jump straight up until you're over the spikes there. It's funny that the icon for this level is a giant muncher uh, and it's spikes and not munchers. Oh, what? I guess that's so it turns around. There's two arrows. I was confused by the two arrows. I wonder if I have to bounce on it twice. next after the Koopas. I assume I'm popping all three of them, but then I have no idea what to do after that. Okay, and then land on the mole, and we're jumping over the spike. I got nosed there. I did not think I was going to make it past that spike. Too early. Too slow. I waited too long on the mole, I think. see what I did wrong there. You just have to go, I think. That should be fine. if I could consistently grab these throw blocks. Uh, you could maybe land on that and then spin off and jump. But you probably need the momentum from the throw block, I'd imagine. I hit right and killed my slope speed. 
Okay, I might switch to spin jump. There we go. That was a regular jump. I short jumped it. Um, I think I made a good time on that uh, sky tree level that just destroyed me yesterday. I, since I didn't, I see this hack is gonna require a lot of video editing for YouTube. Because I don't want to use the episodes where I don't actually beat the level. Oh, okay, that was close. I let the momentum carry me into the spike. I needed more of a controlled jump. But I let that platform get way too low. die at every job, aren't I? But I like this level so far. This is a cool level. Duh. I'm also sort of looking for secrets. did it again. Okay, that was way too far back. I didn't actually spawn the mole until I jumped, so it wasn't where I needed it to be. So far, I think in this hack, I don't know, because a lot of the levels, some of the levels trip me up real bad. Uh, but there haven't been too many spawn dependencies, which I like. I want to be streaming Saturday morning because I'm going to a comic convention. Uh, I probably won't stream after that either more than likely so let's just count Saturday out I guess but I should be back to my usual schedule for Sunday morning I think probably I'm hoping to get another one something cool for the shelf but we'll see what they actually have this year bad. I honestly didn't think I was going to make that, so I wasn't ready to switch back to regular jump. I really like that setup, where it's one mole, and then you go over and there's a second one, and you don't have to do the move with the Koopa on the first one. 
because I can barely get the throw block and land back on the mole. That should not have worked. I'm never gonna get this jump. I have no idea what to do after that because I've not been able to get past the falling platform there. Again, every time, I don't know what is up with me and that one platform. I don't feel like it's any higher than that first one. Ah, short jumped. When I was actually ready for the platform jump, I short jumped and landed on the spike. Ah, it's all that coming. the same timing on the other one. Okay, I see. And then on to the wrecks, and we're waiting for the mole. Okay. This is a really cool level. I really like this one. I can't tell if this is going to be, uh, have two sections, or if there's not going to be a midway and it's just going to end. I feel like it's either going to end shortly after that, or be a midway. Because this first half is pretty long. dropped it. I was trying to kick it. And then we jump off the mole. And then the mole goes through the turn block. Ah, okay. I got a little over there. I rushed to that. I didn't switch to regular jump. slow there. <gasps> Are you kidding me? I... The mall turned around and I didn't have anywhere to land on it. I 
did it again. I guess I just need to hold jump the whole time I'm popping the flying Koopas there. Because I'm letting go to land on the mole a little quicker and I'm falling through. So I have to not do that. Okay, I actually made it on top that time. I will take that. Uh, I'm still waiting for my N64 controller to come in. Uh, but depending on when we finish Nine Years of Shadows and the status of the controller, I may... I still want to replay Ocarina of Time, but I also kind of want to replay an old Pokemon game, just for fun. Ah, oh, that's the second time I was actually able to land on it, but then smashed into that spike. Okay, first time I've missed that throw. Ah, oh, that was supposed to be a re-grab. I thought it was, I thought I was gonna get the re-grab there. I always forget the Rex's hitbox is smaller once they're crushed, so I re-grabbed like it was going to be the big one, which made me get the, uh, the big jump, which sent me into the spikes. Ah, I haven't done that yet. I did not see that coming. That's what I was trying to do. Yes! Get me out. Orb! I usually jump. I usually jump to the end and I was like, I know something's gonna try to kill me. As soon as the screen scrolled, the mole was right there. If I wasn't in the air, I would have totally been dead. Oh, look. Barb switch hole. Last Switch Palace. Spin. Why did I think it was going to be a regular jump? Oh, so this is switching between... I go back in the pipe, I forgot. Let's see who it is. Oh, it's Barb, of course. 
Farmer is king. I did it again. That's the second time in a row I've made it there and forgot which jump type it was. Oh shit, okay. That is a cool setup. I guess I need to big jump there. This is going to be a lot of switching between spin and normal jump, I see. Which I can't do effectively very fast. Oh, okay, let it fall a little bit and then jump. Okay, I have to spin jump at the top of that. Oh, okay, I think I want to spin jump there. I think. Oh, maybe I regular jump and can make it straight from the platform to the other platform, maybe. I knew I was going to hit that. Okay, this is a really cool level. It's hard for me to switch quickly between the jump types, but it looks really cool here when you get it. I should have known the portrait was going to be Barb. Oh. I think I need to normal jump to land directly onto that platform to have time to land back on the other one. Sometimes... Oh, no way! Okay, I think I see what to do now. We're using the middle platform to get to the top one. And then we're jumping from the top one down to the bottom one, and then I assume back onto the top one. Okay, that was close. swung out the wrong way. The momentum was going to carry me into that death block. I don't know what to do about that. Oh yeah, that was close. I heard the jump, but I didn't actually get it. Okay, close. Too big of a re-grab, I guess. I don't know why I normally 
normal jump there. <gasps> I I think you can make that with a spin, I think. Progress though. So I guess the plan is to finish this and nine years of shadows and then go to Entropy and Ocarina of Time and then after Ocarina of Time, I forgot what I was doing, uh, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond or whatever. Okay, close. I let go too soon. This is a cool level. This is kind of like an Ultra Star level with the number platforms, but uh, with the added bonus of a bunch of spin jumps on Spidey's. Jump, spin jump. That's too slow switching buttons. Ah, bigger jump there. I knew I was rushing that. Even the levels that I've gotten stuck on have been pretty cool. I really liked this hack so far. We're more than halfway through now. can't make that with a spin. Okay, I have to immediately jump over with a regular jump to land back on that platform before it falls into the pit. Ah, that's so close. That is a tough jump, that two-tile gap. Especially with the speed you have going through there. Like, it just... The momentum just throws me into that death block. But if I jump more straight up, I won't have enough momentum to actually get through the gap. So it's a very... You need some momentum, but not too much. <gasps> oh, I jumped a little early. Okay, progress. Baby steps. I'm gonna die at every single jump I see. So far, I think we've gotten no yumps. Although that might not be true. I don't remember because it's been so long. I might have got the first one. Which I think was the blue? Maybe not. Duh. I knew that was coming. 
It takes me so many tries just to make that one jump. This does look really cool when you actually get it though. Spin! It's a spin. I saw it too late and my fingers were hovering over the buttons so I jumped too late because I couldn't decide which jump type I needed. That was close. Almost good reads. Oh shit. Okay. I see what to do. I waited way too long on the number four platform at the top. I needed to go right away back to the other one before it finished falling. Okay, maybe it's just a runoff. Maybe I can just run off onto the middle platform there. Maybe that's the trick. Because jump, because with the timing of it falling, jumping any is too much. So I think I'm just gonna run off. Until recently, I was checking every day for news of the Elden Ring DLC, but I haven't done that in days now. I guess I've given up on hearing about it. It all happened when it happens, I guess. Which is why I've scheduled so many other games for us to play after this. I wonder if I can play Paper Mario on the Switch with the Pro Controller or if you need the N64 controller like with Zelda. had to get to the top one a little quicker before it fell. That was good though. Ah, that's the first time I've done that in a couple of attempts. too fast. I was thinking about the other section where you have to go super super fast and that is not that section. I saw that coming. This is a super cool level. Too fast. I think we're also making good progress in nine years of shadows too because uh shit. I need to regular jump those. Because I've got three of the four armor sets. So 
so I feel like I'm getting close to the end of that one. And we're more than halfway through this one now. I... I got tripped up switching jump types and forgot what to do there until it was too late. First time I've jumped too early and hit that death block. jump too long. I feel like that section that I messed up a couple attempts ago was very close to the end. I feel like that was the last jump, except for the troll. I can't believe I've consistently dodged the trolls in like the last two levels. Ah, I saw that coming. That is the toughest jump. Well, one of the two toughest jumps in this level. I think the other one is the one that I missed at the very end. Duh. Spinning messed up my landings and jump timings there, so I wasn't prepared. I have so much trouble switching quickly between spin and normal jump. Memorizing would help, but my memory is so bad I can't do that. Ah, close. That is such a tough jump. I couldn't switch jump types in time, so I spun up here. If I can manage to get to the end of this level, this might be the first time this whole hack that I've beaten more than two exits in one session. No, I made it. I wasn't prepared to switch jump types though, so I was totally going to screw up immediately after I landed on the number platform. Uh, but I didn't get to because I hit the death block. Ah, too slow. That was way too slow. I got stuck on the platform. did it again. I was in the middle of switching jump types and walked off the end instead of ran. Uh, 
so the platform was still gone by the time I got there. Because I was in the middle of switching jump types. dodged the bottom one, which is the one I was worried about, then I hit the top one. had to wait for the platform to fall a little bit. I did not think I was going to be able to land on that other platform before it started falling. So I wasn't prepared when I did actually land on it. I really think that's the end. Ah. I was a little late on the jump off that platform, so I bounced. I was holding right too much and bounced into the death lock. Oh, I saw that coming. I tried to correct and it didn't work. Falling platforms keep their momentum. Haven't done that in a few attempts. I've gotten so many junk phone calls this week, it's been ridiculous. My phone is just going off all the time. This whole week. I don't know what is up with this week. to the comic convention on Saturday. I hope there's a bunch of cool stuff. I'm honestly shocked I made it that attempt. Yes, what's gonna kill me? It's a pipe. I'm like, fish! Oh, what the F? Oh, there's a wing, damn it! Okay, got me.
Okay. At least I know I can get to the end now. I had no idea there was going to be a wing block there. I, it looked like I could get P-Speed and do a, a wild spin jump across. I don't know. I didn't actually land on it. That was so close. What's the problem? Fish. Oh my god. Okay. I might have been able to spin that. Stuff that jumps there. really close. I forgot which jumps to use. One or two more tries. I think I'm gonna break for lunch. If I can actually get my phone to work. Getting on to the wing block is easy. Uh, ah, I got stuck on the platform. Landing back on the wing block is hard. That was way too much of a swing. better if I lose momentum here and then spin. Oh, that was really close. I think I have it. I highly doubt I'm going to get the yump. 
gonna be good just to get to the P switch. Okay, that was not good. I jumped way too early. Yeah, that seems much more consistent if I stop before going. I jumped too early again. I need which jump type I need for which jumps. I barely made that, so of course I'd smash into the death block. jump a little longer there. jump in time, but I didn't actually. That was it. Holy crap, okay. I just wasn't able to switch jump times. So the fish didn't get me, but the last jump to get to the switch did. Twice. the same way I'm messing up the last set of platform jumps too. I'm jumping too early and it's not landing under me. Yeah, I might have to come back and do this one tomorrow. Or Chances are I'll go back to nine years of shadows tomorrow or the next time I stream. I've been fairly good at alternating between this and nine years of shadows. So I'll probably keep that up just to give my hands a little rest between. I think if I can get back there just one more time, I think I can get it. I 
I even stopped and I still hit the death monk. Oh, come on, that was a re -gram. too slow getting off the top platform. Close. I didn't have quite enough momentum there. Oh, my hands are starting to get tired. One or two more attempts and I think that'll be it for today. I guess I'm not getting three exits in one session. Yes, fish. Toad invited to all the parties. He's a fun guy, and I'll see myself out. Okay, that was the last Switch Palace. I think I'm going to call it for today. Three exits. I'm not sure when I'll be back. It'll probably be tomorrow, and probably the other game. Uh, so until next time... <laughs>